Cel mai important lucru pe care trebuie să-l faceți acum este să activați subtitrarea în română. Pe calculator aceasta se face apăsând acest buton și de la rotiță selectați limba. Iar pe telefon apăsați cele trei punctulețe de sus dreapta, apoi subtitrări și selectați limba. Tail price 1 million. 1 million dollar mobile home. Coach. If you have a fight with your spouse, that's how you end. <laughs> right. In Florida, it's free to replace windshields. 200 gallon? Now I understand why it's so expensive. Clipul de astăzi este sponsorizat de World of Tanks, un joc multiplayer online în care te poți lupta în timp real cu alți jucători de pe întreaga planetă. În joc ai disponibile peste 500 de tankuri diferite din primul și al doilea război mondial și o mulțime de hărți. Jocul îl puteți instala și juca gratuit folosind linkul din descriere. Mai mult decât atât, dacă nu aveți deja cont și folosiți linkul din descriere, la înregistrare puteți introduce codul TANKTASTIC și veți primi imediat un start perfect format din un tank sovietic T-127, 7 zile de cont premium și 500 gold. Și asta nu este tot. Pentru că World of Tanks aniversează 10 ani de existență, v-a pregătit multe surprize unice în joc. Atât celor care sunteți deja înregistrați, cât și celor care vă înregistrați acum cu linkul de mai jos. Surprizele de 10 ani sunt valabile doar până la sfârșitul lui octombrie 2020. Așa că nu pierdeți ocazia și înregistrați-vă acum, gratuit, folosind linkul de mai jos, din descriere. Userul meu este Andy Popescu și ne vedem în joc! Hello dear friends, I'm Andy and we are here with my friend Amir. Why did you buy this truck, Amir? I have an RV and I was pulling it with my other SUV which has a lot of horsepower but doesn't have a lot of torque. And when you tow stuff, you need a lot of torque. Horsepower matters less. The way I see it, horsepower is when you really rev the engine and torque is when you have power at low RPMs. Correct, the truck, you see the top maximum RPM is 4000. Yes, because it's a diesel. Yeah, right. So this is a 6.7 liter turbo diesel engine, roughly 450 horsepower, but it has a thousand pounds of torque. When you pull 15, 18,000 pounds behind you, you need that torque. So powerful, this engine, that I need to be reminded that, that I'm towing something because I don't even feel it. With the other SUV that I had, it was struggling. I was getting sway. The brakes were overheating. Just wasn't made for it. Not to tow the type of stuff that I'm towing with it. And I love it so much. As you can see, it's very luxurious. I yes. use it as my day-to-day -day car. It's like I don't even drive my other cars, and I got two more. It's very nice, and I like the LCD. Is that an LCD there? Yeah, the so that's an LCD. And when Yeah, I got it, all the towing information. When uh -huh. we'll connect the RV, it'll tell you the gain. This controls the brakes on the RV. The RV brakes? The RV has electric brakes that are synchronized with the truck. Mm -hmm. I can monitor the air pressure on the tires of the RV. You don't see the rear view mirror. We'll use this. This is a oh, digital yeah. rear mm -hmm. view mirror. Got it. We're gonna see what's behind the RV. If you look at the mirrors. Huge um, mirrors. Yeah, when I tow, I extend them out. Aha, uh -huh, I see it. What are the advantages of having non-motorized RV. Every person must get the RV that right is for designed them. for him, right for them. Like the phone, yes. like the car, like everything. We decided that towable unit is better for us than a motorized unit. I can leave it parked for a year if I don't use it and nothing's gonna happen. I don't have a motor to look after to maintain. It has two bedrooms. You don't have that in a motorhome because at the front of the mo motorhome is always the steering wheel. The disadvantage of a towable unit, you're not allowed to be in the unit while it's being towed. It's, it's not, not safe. It's not safe, correct. But it, it is safe in a, right. in a motorized one. Right, correct. That's fucked up. <laughs> yeah. Around $83,000. Really? Yeah. It's really expensive. $80,000 at this trim level. This is lane centering, yeah. hill descent. Hill descent is like, isn't it a gimmick? Because you can always do it from the brake. So when you tow 15,000 pounds, ah. you're gonna ruin your brakes. <clears throat> How did you break the windshield? Oh wow, this just happened now. When? Just a second ago. A few inches later. It's a towable, they're trying to... Uh, I didn't hear it. Yeah, it just happened now. In Florida, it's free to replace windshields. The state uh, pays for it. Really? Yeah. The state pays for the windshield? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Uh, getting bigger and bigger. Yeah. What's the weight on this car? Eight, nine thousand pounds. And it can tow up to 21,000 pounds. It's like a bull. <laughs> So this truck comes in three configurations, only two seats, half cabin and a full cabin, so this is actually bigger than a regular car, the seats go down, 
and the sole back area turns into storage, which we can show later. How do you know so many? Are you a Ford dealer? No, well, my partner is. Oh, really? <laughs> That's all. Because you talk like a salesman. This yeah. car comes in three <laughs> configurations. I got someone that comes to my house and washes. Oh, really? Yeah. You know how they say, rich man problems. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't go to car washes. I have them come to me. What is your business about? I develop and own RV park, places where people with RVs mm -hmm. come and stay. Really what are the advantages of an RV park? Yeah. Why would you want to go there? Come to a place and you have beautiful, and first of all, you're in nature. You open the door, there's fresh air, swimming pools, lazy rivers, rope courses. It's a great way for the family to go on vacation, relatively inexpensive. Do you need a special driving license to tow RV? You don't, and you don't need a special driving license to drive a bus. Really? You can drive a bus with regular? Yeah. What do you like and what you dislike about this car? You know, it's very long, so the turning radius is not great. It's like a bus. It's all wheel drive? No, so it's a four wheel drive. Here, these are the motorized ones, and each one of these is three, four, half a million dollars. This is one of the world's largest dealerships. They have a hundred million dollars in RV inventory on site. And I will go and talk to one of their top salespeople. So you see here, it doesn't have any, but in order to step inside it, this comes on. What are we doing now, Amir? Right now we're aligning the hitch. And so now we are gonna align the hitch. With the hitch of the travel trailer so I can hook it up to okay yeah and now you're gonna lower it so now i gotta take this off i'll explain to you what's happening okay now yeah. it lowers the car right now i now once this is completely on the ball i can lock it much bigger unit mm -hmm. so we have the sink here we have the grill here and the, the stove, propane no, the stove, the and, stove the oven. and the propane from the front yeah. microwave freezer fridge yeah. the controls for the air conditioning and heating okay the heating works on propane it's gas this is mm -hmm. the heating all these things in the floor. right storage here storage there and the couch there place to stay there Shower, toilet, fan, fan, shower, okay, and shower here. And this is the kid's bedroom. Uh huh. Yeah, let's turn the light on. TV, Apple TV. Uh mm huh. -hmm. Three beds. Uh mm huh. -hmm. This one actually, when you drive, you take it up. Why? Comes up. Mm -hmm. Why you no, take it up? No, because smoking zone. It wanna stay. Right. They can so, sit here, you know, like... So it's three bed, not four bed? This turns into a bed. This goes down and turns into a bed. This lowers this level. Mm-hmm. Got it. So you can have a fourth bed. Yeah. Customizable. So they don't move. The furniture does not move. This one has two air conditioning. Oh, it has one for the kids also. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Makes sense. Yeah, it's very nice for 40,000. You're right, it's a no brainer. 46. Mm -hmm. How many times did you go with it? 
remember it a lot. This is also very interesting to see. So this is unique to it's not a regular refrigerator. What happens here is when you are driving or you are part without electricity, the refrigerator is an auto now, which means that when there's no electricity, it switches to propane. Mm, to keep it cool. Cool? Yeah. Wow, I didn't know that. Right? The biggest advantage is this, you can see, is that this has all my stuff, you know? It's like, we have our own plates, our own cups, knives and forks, um, all our clothes, we have a set of clothes just for the RV. If we decide we go, we just get in the car and we go. We no, don't need to pack. And now we'll go and talk to one of their top salespeople. This is uh, Derek. He's also known as the Wolfman. How you doing? Hello, Derek. Come on in. I've got the air on in this one. Everything you see, even though it's a laminate, it is real. Hardwood poplar. Yes, it's not the cheap one. Right, yeah. it's a hardwood poplar ply. Mm -hmm. Everything. How much is this one? This one is right at about 103,000. It looks very luxurious. Pretty much cannot be improved on. I mean, it, they've been building airstreams like this since 1931. Wow. All the other brands, they build the, the floor on top of the frame mm -hmm. and then they set the cabinetry and then they put the walls on and then the roof and everything you see in here came in through that door wow really so you can completely gut this and it will stay standing you take any other trailer and gut it the walls and the roof will fall down another interesting fact about airstreams is 60 percent of the weight of an airstream is at the floor or below so if somebody pulls out in front of you, this and you have to do a quick lane change, mm -hmm. this will not come up and try to take the truck with it. They're uh -huh. a very low center of gravity. Right. They're the safest to tow. Mm -hmm. And because they're, they're all aluminum, they're, they're very lightweight for their size. So basically the biggest advantage of having one of these is that you can have the comfort of a home in the nature. There's no tank. Mm -hmm. You have endless hot water. Uh, they heat the shower floor. Classic even has a doorbell. <laughs> really? That way you know someone's there and not to answer. Uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, so this is bigger. It is. This is the 30 foot queen bed. Mm -hmm. uh, you actually have buttons right here, so you have power footrests. Looks stainless ex steel under mount sink. <laughs> Now I understand why it's so expensive. You have a glass top here, three burner range, convection microwave <clears throat> oven. When you go with this in a park, what are the price ranges? $30, $35 a night, and okay. that would have water and electric hookup. And you can go to the high side. We have swimming pool, paver, large tennis side. Those can go as high as 150 to 180 a night. Lights, you, you can see over the cabinets in there, that's indirect lighting in the bedroom there. You have that out here as well. The head of the bed raises up electrically. That's the restroom here. The floor of this shower is heated as well. The floor? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Has a, uh, another bedroom with bunks in the back. So now you're gonna see the difference what you get when you have kids and what you get when you don't have kids, right? Uh, so it's a lot more spacious. And this turns into a bed that's a pull out sofa. Uh huh. Okay. Parents are there. In the middle is the living room and kitchen. Mm -hmm. And in the back is the second bedroom. So when your kids are asleep, you can enjoy the living room and kitchen. Here, uh -huh. if your kids are sleeping, you can't watch TV. Right. You can't be this, side. this is. Uh huh. If you got a full shower. Yeah, which is bigger than the yeah. other ones. Yeah, so ba basically more space. Yes. Yeah. Look, look. Mm -hmm. Power awning. 
power stabilizer jacks, power hitch jack, everything's power on the north. Typically, uh, the guys with the Jeeps right pull these this is the base camp x you know this is made for you know unimproved roads things like that uh-huh yeah not off road but less accessible roads right right mm -hmm. has an all-in-one bath still with the porcelain toilet mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. no tv no mm -hmm. stereo right. uh but it does have air uh, conditioning air conditioning that's the air conditioning you know, hot water fresh water tank this is the refrigerator mm -hmm. yep with a little freezer at the top have a sink and double burner stove microwave microwave and here and just storage 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 yep propane gas detector correct it, yes. you can open mm -hmm. yeah and you see yep. outside right i see plugs yes does not have a generator. so you need to plug it in yes uh, my ipad degree view depending on the model TV will either be here or it'll be built into the side of the slide over here uh-huh is this newer model this is not this is an older model oh. so that's 2017 right and this this one is I believe a 15 uh-huh Solid surface countertops, stainless steel sink, dishwasher. This looks so much better from this point of view. Yeah, it's a uh, full bath in the back, a half bath here, so it's a mm -hmm. bath and a half coach. Yep, the char charging stations, you just lay your phone on the nightstand and mm -hmm. it charges your phone. It does charge residential showers yeah and these have uh, and the toilet here yes yes and there it's, it's like just a window with window treatment oh so you can uh yep. emergency uh door here oh, as well this door yep. okay in here this is a full closet in the back cedar uh -huh. lined safe places for shoes yep. safe yep they list the model number and the serial number of each appliance. Mm -hmm. Shower. Yeah. And you can stand there, right? You yes. Can put it and you stand, can stand there, there and it's a rain shower. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Rain shower. Yeah. Got it. TV. Yep. TV. Uh, closets. Closets. Dresser. You can control everything from the coach, from the touch screen pad mm -hmm. here start the generator shut the generator off lights whatever you need. right this is so good because you know i like that the generator makes you independent it does it makes a big difference it does yep you have um fresh water tank second or, toilet <laughs> yep yep it's a bath and a half unit uh all king airs are 45 feet long Oh, flat floor slides so you don't have carpet you don't have uh, big risers that you have to step up onto right because that slides yes it lifts up and comes in same mm -hmm. over here double-sided fridge yes and here that's your induction cooktop this is an all-electric coach there are no LP systems in the King Air Super nice. There you go. TV's coming up, okay. TV up front, TV here, TV in the bedroom, mm -hmm. TV outside, built into the wall for your patio outside. Really? Yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. And this? That, oh, it, that reclines it. Mm -hmm. Can you film me a little? King Air also, uh, it will level from either air suspension mm -hmm. or from hydraulic rams. So whether you're in a soft uh, soil 
or whether you're on a hard parking lot, you can level this coach either way. This is a 2017. How much is one second hand? These would be anywhere in the uh, 800 to 700,000 range, uh, depending on the year and miles and equipment. Each one is $400,000. We are also one of the largest Super C dealers in the country. It is like a whole new world. Shoot you on it. Okay, how much does this cost? This is a million dollar coach. One million dollar coach. 45 feet. So it's a one million dollar mobile home. 605 horsepower. Yes. That's why it says there K3. Yep. <laughs> this coach has a 200 gallon fuel tank. 200 gallon? 200 gallon. That's like it's 500 liters. It even has a dishwasher. Yes. yes. You know, as, a, as an RVer, my favorite thing about it is how quiet the air condition is. Because usually it's not as quiet on an RV. It was, it, I, I noticed that, I actually noticed that in the last one. This is called, Andy, in the RV language, the co-pilot seat. They have their own console that they can control many of the functions on the RV. See here, the air conditioning, the lights. Full massage. Uh-huh. Full massage. Yeah. <laughs> well, and that's probably for the rear view camera, right? It is. It is. Can't believe how many buttons. Visor, 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 shade. Spartan. So Spartan is the brand name. You have a big TV there, yes. big TV there. 54,000 pounds, they're like 20 tons? 20 tons. 20 tons, like 20 small cars. Yeah. You have a full master suite with that, with full bath, and you have a half bath here. So you have a half bath, that's how you call it, mm -hmm. half bath. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and the double side <Yeah>. fridge. <laughs> So many things there. There's a lot of them, yeah. Switchboard <laughs> is on this touch panel here. Yeah. And you just touch it. So you're just staying in bed? Yeah, you can raise and lower the TV, you can mm -hmm. turn off and on the lights. And here? Just more closet space. Closet space. Mm -hmm. Oh, so you have another shower here. Oh, this is the full master bath here, yes, with a uh, tile grouted. Mira, fica de cosa nueva. Sparkle. Ven casa soportes. Are you sure can? Stack washer and dryer. <laughs> Got double sink uh, or double faucet, single sink. Cedar line closet with a safe back here. Also want to get the details because people want to see this, you know? Mm -hmm. When you're when you're behind the screen, you want to see the details. Okay, so uh, Florida law states that you cannot be here while driving or you can. Oh, you can because it's a motorized one, right? Right, you can move around. You can move you around. You need to stay seated. It's a motion sensor. Motion sensor for yeah, what? For, uh, for Light? lights. For yeah. lights. Have a drink out of the fridge or I uh, use the restroom. You can. You have a lot of USB here by the bed mm -hmm. to charge up your phone. Yes. Small cabinets. Actually, you don't even need to use a USB. See this circle here and this light? You Wireless just charger. Lay your phone on there and right. it'll charge your phone. Wireless charger, correct. Yes. On both sides. And this slides? Yes, that'll block that completely off. When you have, want to have some privacy. Exactly. 38,000 in options, suggested repair tail price, 1 million. Mm -hmm. Yeah.
Oh right. So you can lock your yeah. how do you, you you can lock your RV Keyless from here. Entry. Yes. Keyless entry, right? Yep. Doorbell. Yep. Right. <laughs> uh-huh. If you have a back. fight with your spouse, that's how you end exit. <laughs> right. <laughs> But this uh, must be a little lifted, right? Because that's... That's correct. When it starts up, the it... air suspension will uh -huh. lift. Uh-huh. Yes. Okay, air suspension. Got it. K3605. Thank you again. Thank you very much. It was a pleasure. Likewise. Salutări, mă numesc Liviu. Clipul acesta a fost editat de mine. Aș aprecia foarte mult un follow pe Instagram de partea voastră. Instagramul meu este lgsr8. Aștept să îmi adresați orice întrebare legată de editat. Sau dacă aveți nevoie de un edit, vă pot ajuta contra cost. Până data viitoare, nu uitați să dați un subscribe lui Andy și să apăsați clopoțelul.